Jack Kennedy is a very special person, no question about it. Well, just, just for starters, he didn't have to fight in the Second World War. He had a bad back, he had other ailments. John F. Kennedy used his father's influence to get into the war, into combat, and he ended up being a tremendous war hero. So right from the very beginning, we're talking about a special person here. Didn't have to fight, and yet he's a war hero. One of my favorite lines is, the executive officer in his unit rode home, and he said, honey, we got a young, we have young Jack Kennedy in the outfit. He wasn't well known then. His father was, Joe Kennedy. He says he's the only guy in the Navy who's faking good health. So he was a special person. Uh, people spoke about his irresistible charm. Everyone said that about him. His brother, Bobby, people loved him, but people also hated Bobby. They said he was ruthless. Many people did, but they also loved him. But as far as I could determine, everyone seemed to like John F. Kennedy. Look Magazine said even his political opponents liked and respected John F. Kennedy. And as you probably know, when he died, it was said that more people mourned his death than any other human in world history. The thing to me that is the most impressive testament to how special John F. Kennedy was, was the way his death was greeted by tens of millions of people in the Soviet Union and behind the Iron Curtain. The evidence is overwhelming that they took his death almost as hard as we did here in the United States. And everyone talks about his charisma. You know, that only takes you so far. That lassoes your interest. But there's got to be more than that for people to be weeping and taking his death hard. There must have been something in his voice that they picked up, something in the expression on his face. He had a very sincere, pleasant look on his face all the time. Something that enabled his essence penetrate that iron curtain and touch the hearts of millions of people. John Steinbeck, the Nobel Prize winning novelist, he was in Warsaw on a cultural mission for the State Department at the time that news of the president's death reached the Polish capital. And he wrote back, he said, it's the most fantastic thing I have ever seen in all my life. He said, I've never seen such mourning for a human being. And he said, the people of Poland said they had never seen anything like it in all of their lives. We're talking about a very special person here, John F. Kennedy.